Look at the different important properties of definite integrals. These properties are most important for solving the definite integral questions. You should learn it. But first of all, you should understand first property in from 0 to a, sorry, from a to b, f f d f is equal to from b to a, f f d f negative sign. If we are interchanging the upper limit and lower limit, the value of integral will be negative. Number two property is from A to B F F D F is equal to from A to C F F D F plus from C to B F F T F. C is between A and B. Meaning that if two point A and B, if we are taking integral from A to B, we can split into two parts C from A to C, C to B. Then it will be A to, it will be equal to A to B. Next property will be third. From minus a to plus a, a of a of d of is equal to two times from zero to a, a of a of d of. Meaning that this is middle point zero, this is a plus a, this is minus a at equal distance from zero. Taking from minus a to plus a, we can take the integral, take the interval from 0 to a and it will be doubled. But this is only for even function. If f f is even and it will be 0 if f f is f f is odd. Now, what is the meaning of even function and odd function? For example, let us suppose f x is sin x. Replacing minus x, sin x equal to minus sin x. It will be minus f x. Here, replacing x by minus x, the function changes to minus f x meaning that the function will become negative. This type of function is called odd function. If replacing minus x in place of x, the function becomes negative, that type of function is called odd function. And let us suppose another example, f x is equal to cos x. Then f minus x equal to cos minus x equal to cos x equal to f x. By replacing minus x in place of x, the function becomes same function, f x. This type of function is called even function. If replacing x by minus x, the value of the function, the value, the function becomes positive, the function becomes the same. That type of function is called even function. And by replacing minus x in place of x, the function becomes negative. That type of function is called odd function. Another property is fourth property. From 0 to a, f, f, d, f equal to from 0 to a, f, a minus f, d, f. Fifth property is from 0 to 2a, 
एफ एफ डी एफ इज इक्वल टू टू टाइम फ्रॉम जीरो टू एफ एफ डी एफ एंड इट विल बी जीरो इफ एफ एफ इज और एंड इफ एफ एफ इज इवेंट If f f is even, then this value will be, and if f f is odd, then this value will be. odd means putting minus f in place of f, the function becomes negative. That is odd function. The value will be zero. And by putting minus x, the function becomes the same. That type of function is called even function. The value will be double zero to. And this will be zero to a, zero to two a, and the function, the integral value will be zero to a, double zero to a f x t f. Look at a question. Question is given as from zero to pi upon two log sine x d f. Equal to zero to pi upon two log cos f d f equal to minus pi upon two log two. This you have to prove. This question you have to prove. This equal to this equal to this. For solving this, first of all we Shall assume i as i equal to zero to pi upon two log sine x dx equal to I am applying the property of zero to a f x dx is equal to zero to a f a minus x dx. This property I will apply it. Then it can be written as zero to pi upon two. I will rub it because there is no need. Log sine pi by two minus y x d y x in place of y x. A minus this is a. A means pi by two, pi by two minus x d f, and it will be zero to pi upon two log cos d x. Then this equal to this. We have to now we will prove this minus pi upon two log two. Then this is let us suppose this is. Equation number one and this is equation number two. Adding one and two. This is again i equal to this is i equal to this is again i equal to. Then this side two i and in this side zero to pi by two log sine x. d f plus zero to pi upon two log cos f d f. Okay. Then we can write it as zero to pi upon two d x common taking d x common log sine x plus log Cos x dx is common. Here I will apply the rule of logarithm log m plus log m equal to log m into n. I will rub it, rub it because there is no need to write here again. Two i equal to zero to 
पाई अपॉन टू लॉग साइन यक्स कॉस यक्स डी यक्स दिस यम इंटू एन दिस यम दिस यम यम इंटू एन लॉग यम इंटू एन फॉर दिस वी विल सेट ऑफ द फॉर्मूला आइज वी नो दैट टू साइन एक्स कॉस यक्स डी कॉस यक्स इक्वल टू साइन टू एक्स टू साइन एक्स कॉस एक्स इक्वल टू साइन टू एक्स देन here there is no no to then we will set up of as log 2 sin x cos x upon 2 dx divide by 2 and multiply by 2 okay now come to the next step as 2i is equal to जीरो टू पाई पॉइंट टू लॉग वी कैन राइट इट है साइन टू एक्स डी एक्स एंड माइनस जीरो टू पाई अपॉन टू लॉग ऑफ टू डी एक्स बिकॉज वी नो दैट लॉग ऑफ यम अपॉन एन इज इक्वल टू लॉग ऑफ यम माइनस लॉग ऑफ एन दिस इज यम दिस इज यम एंड दिस इज एन देन लॉग यम माइनस लॉग एन देर फोर दिस इज लॉग यम माइनस लॉग एन इन सेपरेट इंटीग्रेशन नाउ टू आई इक्वल टू जीरो टू पाई अपॉन टू लॉग साइन टू एक्स डी एक्स माइनस लॉग टू इज कॉन्स्टेंट देर फॉर इट इट विल बी आउटसाइड ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन जीरो टू पाई अपॉन टू वन टी एक्स ओके हियर वी विल सब्सिट्यूट सब्सिट्यूशन विल बी एज टू एक्स हियर साइन टू एक्स एज लेट एस एज यू टू एक्स इज इक्वल टू थीटा देन टू डी एक्स इज इक्वल टू डी थीटा देन डी एक्स इज इक्वल टू डी थीटा अपॉन टू वी विल चेंज द अपर लिमिट एंड लोअर लिमिट ऑल्सो फॉर दिस इफ यक्स इज जीरो देन थीटा इज जीरो एंड इफ यक्स इज पाई अपॉन टू देन थीटा इज पाई देन वी कैन राइट इट एज टू आई इज इक्वल टू दिस अपॉन टू थीटा अपॉन टू जीरो टू पाई लॉग साइन थीटा एंड इन प्लेस ऑफ डी एक्स वी विल राइट डी थीटा अपॉन टू डी थीटा एंड अपॉन टू मीन्स हियर वन अपॉन टू एंड माइनस लॉग टू This one dx means x zero to pi upon two. I will rub it because there is no need to write. I have set up the upper limit and lower limit. Now we we apply in this integration. We will apply the प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ जीरो टू टू ए एफ एफ डी एफ इज इक्वल टू टू टाइम जीरो टू जीरो टू एफ एफ डी एफ जीरो टू टू ए टू विल बी मल्टीप्लाई फॉर इवन फंक्शन फॉर इवन फंक्शन देर फोर टू 
i is equal to 1 upon 2 it can be set as 0 to 2 pi upon 2 2 multiply 2 divide pi can be written as 2 multiply 2 divide pi upon 2 into 2 log sin theta d theta minus log 2 upper limit minus lower limit. Now there is no need to write it. I will rub it. And 2i is equal to half by the application of 0 to 2a fx dx equal to 2 times fx dx. Therefore, 2 will be multiplied to 0 to pi upon 2 log sin theta d theta minus pi upon 2 log 2. Now I will write it, rub it. Now come to the solution 2 to cancel. This is 0 to pi upon 2 log sin theta d theta. This is equal to i because if i assume theta is equal to x then d theta equal to dx then replace by log by x theta by x log sin x dx the result will be same as i have solved from the previous therefore it is i minus pi upon 2 log 2 i will be Transferred in this side, 2i minus i is equal to my minus pi upon 2 log 2. i is equal to minus pi upon 2 log 2. This is the solution of question.